Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Melanie and I do food hauls. This is part two of my weekly food haul. Part one went on for about 5,000 hours, so if you've not watched that, you may want to skip it. So I'm going to be doing part two and it's everything that's in the fridge, so I'm basically filming in the fridge. So it's just easy for me to film out the fridge rather than get everything out and put it back, especially after the marathon part one I just filmed. So this is from Tesco. It's the Tesco Finest Wild Garlic Crispy Chicken Kievs. They don't have a great date on. It's the 12th today, so that's Monday. So they need eating ASAP. But that was the best date-wise. I think they had something with the 14th on, which, you know, I wouldn't pay £5.50 for something that's going to go off tomorrow. Signature pork sausages. By the way, I do have the flash on, so if you're wondering what some of the weird colours are, like that yellow dot on the first sausage, it's just I put the flash on because even though it's only about six o'clock, maybe half past six, it's a little bit dark outside because of rain, even though it's not raining right now, but it's cloudy. These are normally four pounds, they're an offer for three fifty. I haven't picked these up for a while, they're not for me. But I, there was a time when I was getting them quite a while ago and they really enjoyed them and then I couldn't get them for, I didn't see them for months and months and months. I don't know if they'd stopped doing them or if they were just permanently sold out. But when I spotted them today, I thought, well, I'll get them because I'll probably enjoy having these because they enjoyed them last time and they did say they're actually tasty. I have got them a smooth and buttery classic mash. And by the way, you'll notice I've got them four meals because it's two sausages a time and then a key of a time. They have a pie because they got three pies yesterday. I did have one of them because I'd run out of food. I did have some tofu, but I had tofu for my lunch and I didn't want it again. And I did have vegan stuff in the freezer, but I knew they had a meat and potato pie because it is meat and potato. Like the meat content is so high. Um, so that's what I had and they still have a pie left and they're also going to get three pies towards the middle and like Wednesday, Thursday next week so they're going to be having pies a lot <laughs> so yeah they, they've got four meals and then they've got some mash I've also got them bacon and I believe they've got a full packet now they never know and I do get two because you save money because they're 3 50 each or two for £5 so obviously you might as well get the two for £5 yeah, I could have spent the £5 on something else, but they never know if they've got bacon or not. And a lot of the time I know, but because of what's going on in my life, I'm so stressed out all the time. I just couldn't think if they had a pack left or not, or if it was open. But yeah, they do. So I could have got the bacon next week, but that always happens if they're left to decide if they've got it or not. I've seen these a few times and I've almost picked them up. There's like a beef burrito bowl. There is a spicy chicken one and then there is this chili chicken the main reason i've not picked any of them up is basically because i think the full price at 450 and when they're on offer i think they're 375 and i think for what it is it's a lot of money and i know well del paso is a well-known brand and like they do a lot of good things and i know you're paying for the convenience of the meal already being made but i think for 450 full price is quite a lot. I think it'd be more like four pounds and offer for 350, 325. But I did quickly look through the ready meal section, and because I'm not really enjoying food, and like I've seen to have gone off a lot of things, and I don't know why, nothing stood out to me. And I went like on the end of the aisle to see if there was anything on there. And these were only the kind of things that I would probably get. And like, I'm just not impressed. Like, I'm not impressed with the price. And I'm hoping for the money, it's good. Got some British Eve's Delight strawberries. They're an offer of £2 instead of free. In Asda, I got four of the Arla Protein Strawberry Yogurts. Last week, I only got three, which you wouldn't have seen because there was an incident in between filming part one and part two, so I didn't film it. But some days, I will have one of these as well as a smoothie, depending on how I'm feeling. Now, I have been ill on and off for the last two weeks, and I don't feel too bad today. But I didn't have a smoothie for breakfast. I had something else. But if I was having a smoothie and I was going to do my typical dog work, walk that I do Monday to Thursday, because it does change on a Friday, I probably would have had one today, um, especially with running around shopping. Well, I wouldn't do it today, but there's been a couple of days where I've had it. 
But anyway, the main reason I've been getting them again is A, as they were stocking them again, and also they were a pound on offer. And I wish they were a pound full time because I would buy them more often or I'd buy more of them. Then I got the then I got the Edinarme bean and broccoli stir fry. Last week I did get the Tesco one, which I think is 50p more, but there was a lot more in it. Like you actually got tender stem broccoli in it. There wasn't as many Edinarme beans, but I wish I'd gotten this from Tesco now just because there's double the amount. Um, and obviously double is better than this size. So next week I'll probably get it from there. And I have been having stir fry a lot. In fact, I should have got two stir fries because in the week, I really wanted to put stir fry vegetables with something and I didn't have it. And I can't go to the shop because if I drive off in my car, my neighbours harassing me and doing all they can to affect me. And they're basically stopping me from parking where I've parked for nine years, knowing that I have severe anxiety. And then I got the kilogram of chicken breast fillets. There wasn't actually many. And then some had Sunday's date on and I was like, I want something to at least the 18th. And there were two packs with 19th on. The chicken doesn't look great, but, you know, it'll do. Coconut water smooth. I mean, when's it never smooth? This was in the world food section. They do a couple of um, energy drinks in the same section in the world food. And I grabbed it thinking it was one of the energy drinks because they come in like a smaller can like that. Um, they're not the best. Like, they don't give you the most energy. I think they're more natural than some of the energy drinks you can get. And then I saw it was coconut water. I was like, oh, I'll get that. I've not actually had coconut water in a long time. I used to get it frequently, like in a, a carton, like a tall carton, but I just don't get it that often. It doesn't taste as good in a can, but I was like, do you know what? I've not had any for ages. It'd be nice. These are a pound in Asda. But like I said, if you watch part one, Tesco's free Starbucks for three pounds, and I wish I'd gotten that. But knowing I'd already got one of these in asda that's why i got the two cans of coffee if you would have seen part one you'll know what i mean last week i got um tesco's own smoothie it comes in like a clear bottle it's like a liter or something and i got the strawberry one which was strawberry and banana and it was super tasty and i was going to get one again this week but a different flavor then i spotted the tropicano tropicana pineapple like i think it's called golden pineapple was an offer for 250 instead of three and I'm like, I wish it was two pound. I bought it at 250. I do really like it. Do you know what? I should have got it. And then I spotted this at two pound. I was like, do you know what? I'll get something different. Because obviously I've had the pineapple one and I wish I'd got it. Do you know when you you don't get it because you're like, oh, like I wish it was like two pound instead of three. But they're obviously selling it at 250 because it is it's like I've had the um Tesco's own brand one and like that's an 8 out of 10 and the Tropicana's like 10 10 like oh god it's good but I got this just to be different because I thought it's nice to try different things or well have different things I got two almond milks two almond milks in Asda I've got one open one open and three unopened I didn't know I had that many apparently I'm, I'm stocking up good job they've got like September's dates on I have a full coconut milk and one with like not enough for even one drink so but that'll last me because it's just for coffee i do have four of the gym kitchen high protein salted caramel i should have got eight do you know what you save five uh, you save two pounds because if you buy them individually it comes to five pounds but if you buy four for three pounds you save two pound i should have got eight so i can have one a day and then one surplus because there will always be one day where i'll definitely have two and last week when I only had four, there was days when I missed not having it. So next week, if they're still in the three for, for, four for three pound, I think I'm going to get eight of them because these are so tasty. Then I got the GU or Goo Chocolate and Cherry Cheeky Pot. They're an offer for two pound instead of two ninety. They did have one called Double Chocolate and I was like, I'm not going to pick that because potentially it's going to be like a dark chocolate or like it might be milk and dark. That wouldn't have been too bad, but I'm not a dark fan. And I've never tried the cherry chocolate ch and cherry. Um, it is new and it's got not many calories. And I've not had a GU pot for ages. Then I got the crunchy sweet, sweet leaf and carrot salad i think that's what it says it has a good date on it i got the mccain home chips the crinkle cut ones 
because they're on offer for two fifty, and the Tesco's own are two pound forty. So I think it might be a slightly smaller bag, but I got the branded ones, and I got the branded ones last week, which are there just because they're on offer. I know I didn't film last week, but this is one of the things I got. I got the Green, green Cuisine Southern Chicken Free Summer Fried Strips. They're not bad. I did actually put three on a wrap with some like lettuce leaves and some kind of sauce. It might have been mayo, it might have been something else. And they're not bad. Anyway, back to this week, I did get, I got the Beyond Burgers because I got them at the freezer section, which I do prefer them fresh because they do taste better. And I've actually frozen fresh ones before, before so they didn't go out of date. And when I've cooked them, they've just not tasted as good. But these are the best fake burgers you can ever have. And I've tried every one that I've seen in shops. I'm not saying there's none other ones. There is no other ones. The ones that I've seen in shops, every shop that I've been in that does them, because obviously I don't go in every single shop and not every shop st stocks every brand but these are by far the most realistic smell and taste and texture wise to an actual burger and I did get the imperfectly perfect bag of frozen fruit for smoothies and I'm hoping that is absolutely everything that I got this week if you want to know why the coconut milk's back to front I mean, if you watch my videos, you'll know. When it's open, I turn it back to front so I know what's open and what's not open. So, I know. But because I've, I did that because sometimes I'd, I'd have two almond milks. I would think one was an op I would think one wasn't open and then I'd open it to find out that I did have one open. So then I'd have two on the go. So that's why I turn them backwards when they're open. If you have any questions, please feel free to leave them down below. If you're new to my channel or you watch my videos but you aren't subscribed, please subscribe. Don't forget to press the notification button to get an alert when I upload. I hope you have the most amazing day. Thank you so much for watching.